Hello, Steamy495. And we, I am starting new. Uh, where is the thing? Oh, here it is. Yeah. Okay, starting a new Let's Play. The only one I got going right now is Paper Mario 2. And. That's about over, and I'm not in the mood to go any farther in it. I'm not ready yet. Not I made the preparation, so uh, okay, as you can probably read, yes, I'm doing Super Mario. Sunshine, whatever. Anyway, first thing I want to show off is. If you wait a while, they will sh you get to see the demo, or the not the demo, but the like preview. I think they played at some type of video game place like E3 or something, something along the lines in 2001 game demo. They they you know played it when they I don't know something like that. I don't know exactly what to call it. All I know is it's called it like a game demo. Like here it is. Yeah, I think that that's um, a preview of the game when it was in works because obviously he doesn't make that weird sound when he's wall jumping. We're gonna go um, the B and uh, the Brock doesn't sound like that. <laughs> well, she doesn't fucking drugs or something. Guy yeah, tripping out, bitch. Drugs worn off, huh? <laughs> well, she's in heat, huh? That's nice. Find some assistance. And who wants to take care of that? Sorry, chocolate. Touching. Anyway, I have a bad feeling about this, huh? Anyway, controls B. There's that, um, no punching or nothing like 64. I can check it out, yeah. Oh, that's right, I did. Um. Let's see, I did 64 and then Super Mario Galaxy. The reason I didn't do this one before Galaxy is because, first of all, I was more in the mood of Galaxy. And second of all, I didn't have this game. I lost, not lost, but my copy had tons of scratches on it. And to the point where it would never work past the Dolby advertisement sign there. And why there's a pink plane, I have no idea. Princess Peach, why we drive? Why are we on your private jet? <laughs> um, a thing that sets this game off from the others is the big one that I heard people just bitch the storm about is the fact the fact that it's voice acting instead of just you know, complete voice acting instead of like text or something. 
Except, luckily, Mario doesn't. Otherwise, they really would have hated this game. Like, people, especially true fans, would extremely hate this game. Like, that would that would have been, like, no. I mean, even I would have been like, eh, no, no. Really, the voice acting's fine. I don't give a shit. I actually prefer it. Like, <laughs> but, um, I guess, and, uh, let's see, I don't know why they're bitching, because Princess Peach talked at the end of Super Mario 64, so, but, that's fine, though. And they don't talk all the time, so it's fine. Nothing wrong with that game. I don't know, that's just one of those things people bitch about. What am I doing? I'm wasting time. Anyway, there you go. Flood. Well, you're welcome. We didn't purchase it. No, we didn't buy this. It was just in, in the corner there. It shows a bunch of scenes from pre previous games. Pretty cool. Yeah, this is the life. This is the main attraction of the game and a lifesaver. This game would be impossible without flood. I think you turned it up a little, hang on. Oh, it's not working. No, actually... I think that's fine. Yes, ma'am. Okay. No. Why would I want to listen to that again? You can see, lightly press it down, move while you do it. Or you can zoom in, do this, or you can hold it down and move up and down. Or you can press R and then, like, do that. And, like, I don't know, whatever. L, I meant. Press, hold down L. Let's see. Jumping. From compared to Super Mario 64 and even Galaxy, first of all, my favorite jump, personally, one of my favorite, pretty much my favorite jump, is the long jump, and it's not in this game. Uh, that got taken out, for, taken out for some reason. Uh, another jump that's not in here is the backflip by holding down the crouch button and crouching and crawling and stuff. That's all gone. Instead, you get that locking and. But the but this is a jump that you'll use a lot. This jump, and you may find yourself using that all the time. That is actually a new jump, the spin jump. It's for many things. You can clean yourself once you get covered in this ugly goo. And you can also jump in water. And swimming's a bit different. Uh, personally, I don't like the swimming in this game. It's kind of annoying how you the B B's down and A's up, and you can't just go forward. You have to go, and you know, it's just a little irritating. Annoying, it can be better. I like it better than Galaxy and Super Mario 64, even. But, um, the graphics are really pretty and nice. Ground pounds, uh, let's see. R is for uh, X is changed to hover nozzle. And there's also two other nozzles you can lock later and change them out. You can only have two at a time. And you do things with that. Um, the hover no uh, the hover nozzle is your best friend in this game. Trust me when I say you will love it. Um, you're gonna love having it because if you don't have it, because you you're just not gonna it's just not gonna work out. You know. Um, if you don't use it properly, then you you're just gonna suck like a little five year old playing this game. Like, yeah. uh, no offense, but jeez. Um, Definitely one of those things that you probably should definitely use. As a matter of fact, you're required to use it a lot. Um, everyone thinks it's you. Uh, we'll get into that later. I'll get into that one later. Yes, ground pound simple blocks. You can press B to talk to people and read what they have to say. This is the one poster someone sketched. It is obviously... Obviously, we're not the perpetrator because we literally just got freaking here. How the hell did we do it? 
Um, I don't know, but apparently these idiots think so because they're stupid. Um, especially since when you see the difference between this Mario and the Mario that actually did it, you'll be like, what the fuck? But, oh well, you know, it's game. It's game logic and stuff. It's, it's just Nintendo logic. I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just messing around. I'm just kind of getting controls, camera controls, control stick, obvious, camera stick. Duh. You know, pretty simple stuff. You can pause. Um, you cannot pause when you're jumping at all. And you can only exit the stage when you're standing still. You can't really pause when you're moving. Well, you can't. No, wait. When you're moving, yes, but... What the? Oh. Whoa. No. Um, there's gonna be these things throughout the game a couple times, few times, I think. Not that many. And you just scored them in the mouth a few times, and, well, they, they, they go away and they restore whatever they were covering, blocking, and get rid of. And so there's our first Shine Sprite. Uh, it's not Power Stars like the other ones. It's Shine Sprites, which are cool. I like them. Um, Mario's short sleeve instead of long sleeve because he's on vacation. And he... Yeah. Here's a long ass cutscene for you. <laughs> Zip. Yeah, you wanna use... Holy crap. Almost. Mario. Were you on the shrooms again? Ew. Who took a shit? That's a big shit. Did the sewer leak or something? I know. Much smell. Much food. Going to people's houses and they're like, what the heck? And then they go outside and it's like, shit. Why isn't there corn in there? Never mind. Someone. Someone took a big octopus and made it squirt. On there. Work the rest of that room and the jury and stuff. Why is it black? So, clean a whole entire fucking island. I only collected it and held it in my fucking hand. <laughs> not with I'm, no, I'm here. You know what I mean. I always thought as a kid that that was like butter or soap or something you know, on a table or something like that. No, I do not want to hear that shit again. But it's just, it's just bed and pillow. Why are you just sitting crisscross applesauce? With hover flood on, obviously on the floor when he could just sit in bed and lie there and listen to Flo. Well, could he lie down, like, on his back? He can't lie on his back, that's why. He has to lie on his side or stomach. Which I usually do on my side. That's nice. Some took a nice shit with a clump. 
their shit just got clumped up with hair or something in the mid, just got in the middle. Some wor they had worms because this big worm thing still come out of it. Okay, that's stupid. Okay, so we're gonna get going here in a minute. Uh, let's put those aside. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I had a couple Hershey bars because these fucking cutscenes are ridiculous. They're pretty retarded, actually. Um, not really. They're cool. Um, first off, I want to check out the beach. I'm going to comb the beach, and there's actually these things called um, manholes in this game, which you ground pound in. And that one's the only hidden one in the game. And there's one ups. The one ups are a pretty decent size in this game. Zip, um, zip, as in unzip my pants and pull out my wiener. Um, yeah. So, or you know, pull down, unzip someone's pants. So, or my pants, or you know, it depends if it's a female. If I'm, it's just like a female. So anyway, you know, zip, unzip, zip. Huh. <laughs> right here is another one up. Beach cone. Whoa, that was glitchy. <laughs> Bye. I want out of here. <laughs> Cover flood. Okay, so first off, we're not gonna clean that up. I'm actually gonna get a star <laughs> right here, right now. That blue bird comes important later. Actually, I could do it right now, but I don't really want to get that bird right now. I'd rather go to wait until we get a <laughs> something later. But right now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna first I'm gonna break this block. And you know what? A block. It's a crate. I'm gonna squirt this. I'm gonna get a blue coin. Now, blue coins are different from any other Mario game, like Super Mario 64 per se. They are actually important. There's about, I, th I believe, 260, and then you turn them in for 10 coins apiece at this certain shop, and there's 24 star shine sprites that you can get in this, in this and it's in Delfino Plaza from blue coins. So. Uh, yeah, if you want 100% the game like I'm doing, you're going to have to collect blue coins, which a bot, some of them, especially in a level later, can be a pain in your ass. Trust me. Ugh, I do not like it. I've never 100% this game before. I came close with 119 stars. Um, there are some ridiculously hard stars, but most of the stars are easy. I'll go over the hard stars when we get there. Uh, I don't know why people are just running around rambling. I should probably do stuff while I'm talking. Anyway, so, are you pathetic? Are you fucking pathetic? Anyway, the first star you can get without having to go clean up that stupid mess is the first bell out of two. Two dirty bells. That bell you need the uh, rocket to get to, and the stars only go high up. The shine gate, same thing. You can get it to it, but when you clean it, the star will go way too high. So this is the only one you can get, because the star for this one will go somewhere that you can actually ask access. Anyway, so you just basically squirt the fucking thing until it's fucked up the fucking ass. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. You squirt it until it's all clean and clean. And then, see, there's the star. And then how you get in there, you go over here to this pothole only will get you, only this one will get you in there. You know? So then you go under and go over and over and over and then you do some jumping. Oh, 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 I've never done that before. Whoa, wow. Whoa, wait, hold on. I've always gotten that star with the moon up. I wanted to see if I can get it with the sun. No, it's all, it looks like it always has to be the moon. Either way, that's one star. Now, okay. So yeah, there you go. That's the earliest you can get that star. So, yeah, that's the second star you can get in the game. Uh, another thing is there's this... This, there's this trick, right? I'm gonna try it a couple times and move on if I don't get it. Where you get up here to the Stargate, and there's a whole level on top of this whole place. Now you need the certain, you need the rocket basically to get up here and later in the game. But you can kind of get up here now, but it's pretty difficult. First, you gotta do this. 
Yeah, see, you gotta pull off a triple jump and then, like, do, and then just kind of get up there with the hover flood does the rest. Oh, man, and then you can enter it and do the first four stars, and the fifth one you can't do without, um, something else. So, and you can't do them out of order like Super Mario 64. Sad face. Yeah, so basically, yeah, okay, you know? So yeah, triple jump, but I've done it before, and I, I wish I could do it now, but I don't want to waste too much time. And if I get lucky and do it, that that's just whatever. But, I wish I could really show it, but, um, I can't show it. But I, I told you what to do, so go ahead and try it. It's, it's possible, I've done it. See, it's not that hard, but it's hard, actually. It's pretty difficult, actually. Here we go. And then you can get there without even going to the first level. That's actually the last world you have that you, you know, in, in the order that they throw them in. Like, from lineup to lineup. And kind of where you're supposed to, when you go to it. But, you know. You know? You know? A little bit about this game is there are seven levels. Seven um, main levels. And that's basically it. And there's eight stars and there's eight plus two hidden plus. Okay, so eight plus three. So there's eleven stars in each level. So there's eight main missions. Well, okay, seven main missions, an eight episode, uh, eight bonus mission, and two secret stars and a hundred coin stars. So I think that makes eleven for each. So seven eleven. That's funny. I just noticed that. And then good thing it's not nine eleven. Fuck, they would have been in a lawsuit. No, I'm just kidding. They lost it, I'm just kidding, but they would have been noticed and be like, yeah, that's kind of funny. Or not funny, but weird. No, what the fuck, lawsuit? You don't get lawsuits for that. That's a coincidence. Unless they did it on purpose in a hurtful, meaningful way. And they admitted it or something as a terrorist attack. Or, I don't know, what the hell I'm talking about, man. Oh, stupid. That's stupid. Anyway, um, I have just beat this guy's ass in like a matter of seconds. Like, I've pulled him over before he even got out of the shadow here. But, let's, so, so let's see where I can get him now. Yeah, I typically get him around here, but I sometimes I get him really close. Tools like that, it's just water, dude. He swims in water later. Mario, I'm sure I saw that person out in the airstrip. The airstrip seems like somewhere you go to see a stripper strip and stuff. And that, that's kind of enjoyable. You don't care. They don't give you anything, so it's not really useful to clean them up. Um, he's waiting here. Like, what does he do? I didn't even see it. Actually, maybe now I can see it here. What does he do? I never can tell. See a good close up picture of what he does. What's he doing? I always thought he's just kind of drinking beer. Like, he's like, no, no, like, drinking something. Oh, no, wait. Oh, he's laughing. Oh. Anyway, this is the... Yeah, this, so this is... So, yeah, so this is the Mario that's polluted the whole town. And basically everyone thinks it's us because he looks like us. So, so, so... How are they getting us mixed up? Red and... Red and blue overalls and like real perf like looks real versus shiny blue all over. Are they like colorblind? Maybe. No, I don't know. All I know is that they're pretty stupid. But oh well, that's fine. Whatever. Now there is a trick in this. There is tons of glitches and tricks and just tons of stuff and little little things that you can just do to skip the most of the game and a lot of things like that at the very beginning of the game not so much uh, in the future of the game but definitely in the beginning you can just break not break the game but like just skip a bunch of skip a bunch of things like yeah so in this one you're supposed to whoop this guy's ass and, but, um, I'm pretty much, I have to, um, I could do some tricks to get up to the bridge, because I, this will make a hill up to that bridge, obviously, I mean, if that, if that isn't obvious, what's wrong with you? 
And basically, he's really easy and pathetic. So, yeah. So, yeah. After you beat him, he makes the hill. Now, you're supposed to collect a star after it, that's on this hill after you beat him. But, this is the only time you can do um, a star out of order in this, in this particular game. Because this game doesn't allow out of order um, stuff. You can't go out of order with the stars, okay? Like, in the, in the levels, you know. In the main, in the seven main levels. But this one is the only time you can break the order and go to mission two instead of doing mission one. Which is climb up here and fight PD Piranha after, since after this game has been a staple in a bunch of Mario series. From Mario Kart to um, Mario mm, Strikers and um, 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 what other game? Mario Galaxy, I guess, because I mean they have like his baby or something in the first two ga in the two games, which is funny how huh? Super 3D Mario game had a sequel. It's because it was so popular and there's so many, I, a matter of fact, it was, first of all, it was obvious, they say it was because there's so many ideas, and that's really the main reason, but it's also because what they didn't say was, um, it's for profit and it's popular. Too bad you can't just get the shine sprite and then be like on top of his head, but they make sure you can't. I love this moment where they look up at each other here in a minute, moment, because he's, that roar cracked a roof, apparently. And see, they look up at each other like, Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright. Oh, yes. There's also this trick. Um, don't get too close to him. He'll bang you around. There's this trick with the flood where you can spin and do this. And you score it around. Um, basically what you do here is you wait for an opening when he opens his mouth to, ah, oh, you fuckers, to squirt it up. And then you squirt his mouth, basically you kind of, you pump him. You pump him. And then you ground pound it out of him. And that's how you hit him. Three times the charm. Don't get too close again. You can move while doing this. You can do, so you rotate the stick and then you press R, hold down R. You can also jump and squirt, and that is very useful, actually, for cleaning up places and just fun to do sometimes, and it's going to be required. So, for me, it's pretty much required to do 100 coins in this level. Um, I don't think I will be doing 100 coins, like, like I'm not going to be, like, doing this in an order and be, like, strictly doing all eight missions and then, or, well, you know, because I can't, first of all. And second of all, because that'd just be boring, and that's not the way I like to play. Really, I kind of like to play in diff a weird order. I just kind of just go randomly, and then... I like to guess where the star is sometimes. I always get it wrong, though. Oh yeah, I love the click-clack sound Mario's shoes makes in this game. Anyways, third shine. I almost said second. <laughs> it's third because I got that one. Blue coins, there's about 200, I think there's 260. Uh, you turn them in 10 coins a piece. Uh, 10 coins at a time to get one sh spine sh shine sprite. In that particular building right there that you unlock here. And uh, yeah, 24 fucking shine sprites. <laughs> and these raccoon dealer guys. Yeah, pretty... Pretty risky, risque business. Um, red coins are extremely popular in this game. <laughs> See, we skipped the number one. I'll come back to number one later. But anyway, red coins are extremely popular. <laughs> Not only are there one red coin mission per, per at least one, um, in, in the main civilian, right? Wait, yes, 
of each. Oh no, wait, no, no, lies, lies. But, but in most levels, okay? They're in the main pavilion, there's going to be um, an episode where you have to go collect eight red coins in, you know, the overworld. Like, or your, you know, the l l level. And then there's others that are secret shines, and these are hidden in these secret levels that we're heading to now. Where once you beat them, the f after you beat them the first time, you go back into them. Well, let me explain that in a minute. Yes, I, I'm glad I got the snoot. I, oh, no, 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 no. I'm glad I can use this phone. Uh, this better phone to record videos. Not only does it give you, I believe, bigger video, better, well, not bigger, but better, I, I'm pretty, definitely better quality. Uh, better size, obviously, with the TV. Uh, yeah, anyways, these levels, uh, Shadow, that, Shadow Mario, I guess I like to call it. Shadow Mario! Holy crap, Shadow fucking Mario. Shadow? Yeah, it's Shadow Mario, man. Sorry, but I just thought of something because I was I, I I've been addicted to eBay. Not addicted, no, but I like eBay now, and I've been getting Mario figures, and I've been kind of looking up kind of what I want to get. And Shadow Mario would be would be one that I thought, think would be badass if they did it with nice cool paint or whatever. But but I got a I got like twenty something in the mail the other day. Uh, I got a Bowser, Mario, Waluigi, Wario. I love Waluigi. That's my favorite character. Sadly, he doesn't have his own game. Although, if he had his own game, that'd probably ruin him because he is kind of one of those secretive, just kind of one of those characters, you know? He's just kind of there for the parties and stuff. But, you know, you never know. A lot of people kind of want a game, but I think, I mean, personally, it could go either way. Either way. These are the levels that show off your classic Mario platforming skills with no flood, because flood does not have your back, and you cannot cheat with that. So that's the cool part. And then when you're done, you go back into them, hit a red coin switch, and you do eight red coins, timed, time limit red coins. Yeah, that's pretty popular in this game, too. And, um, yeah, you have to collect them before the time limit's out. And it's not too bad since you got flood, but... That's, you have to have flood, so I'm gonna go do that one right now because I just want to get those out of the way when I do them. Most of them, not all of them, but I just want to show this one off because it's the easiest and I feel like doing it. Um, and that counts as a secret star. There's usually two of these like little places you go to do platform, classic plat Mario platforming. In every level, sometimes there's only one because there's another type of secret star that you do some some other special mission for, or a special type of thing, and then that's pretty rare though. So most places only have two of these these type of areas, and then they have that's their two secret stars, and then they all have 100 coin missions, which obviously, as you know, if you might have noticed, red coins do not count as coins anymore. Neither do blue coins. They refill health, but they do not count to your coin total like Super Mario 64. The only coins that will go to your coin total are the regular gold, gold coins, and that are only coins in this game. One up mushrooms f refill all your water and all your health if you die. You have health, eight health points. No matter what it is, nothing will take more. Nothing that happens to you in this game will take more. No matter how long the fall, how hard the hit, whatever it is. Pretty much nothing, except for the very end of the game, that I'm not going to spoil. We'll only do one damage, one, one hit point out of eight, so you're good. Um, of course, falling off the edge will obviously kill, instantly kill you, and if you, um, if you're in one of these secret levels, you will get start back to the start of the secret level. Uh, if you are just in the level in general. You will get booted out to the beginning outside the Delfino Plaza. It's kind of which is kind of annoying because you have to go and then you have to jump back in, select your star and stuff again. 
And if you get a game over and you're in a secret course or something and whatnot, then you have to go start from scratch, basically. If you get and um, in this game, unlike any other Mario game, uh, basically 3D Mario game at least, lives are stacked, so they're saved. So you, when you lose, when you just quit, and when you save and quit, your lives get saved, and they appear. Are you kidding me? Pathetic. Anyway, they appear when you next play the game. Um, Super Mario 64 did not do this. You always had to start with back to like four, three, what was it, four? Yeah, I believe it was four lives. This game you start with three lives, but that's that's fine because the more any lives you get, as long as you save and quit, you will have your lot, whatever lives. So you can get potentially like hundred lives and keep them and keep going and keep going so yeah that's the thing about this game that I really which is kind of you know so oh yeah you know main 3d Mario game not like Super Mario 3d land I'm talking about like a, one of the main four or is it five now I, oh, whoa, 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 big star okay you can get on top of these but I don't want to Oh, 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 16 seconds left. This is the bitch. There are some where you're, like, jumping and flooding for a coin, and they, and then this is the last red coin, and then it does this, and you're like, oh, and you're over a pit flooding, and you're like, oh, 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 oh. but luckily the timer stops after you collect the last red coin, which is a lifesaver, obviously. So, can I make it? Thank you. Now let's not fall off and get to the end. So... I need a life after that pathetic performance. And then that's the secret stars for most cases. And there's, and, um, I know all the secret stars. I know every star in this game. Baby. So, sorry, got interrupted there. Um, I'm gonna go unlock this. Uh, actually, I want to keep going. I want to get the red coin. <laughs> yes, there's a red coin mission next. So, so, and if you can't notice by now, this is a pretty long video. That's because I've been gone for a while. I was gonna make that Paper Mario 2 Part 66 episode longer, but. Um, the thing about that was the batteries on the phone was dying, so I had, I just like just stop, and I didn't want to go any further. But this this is my big return. This is my big big return video. I'm actually going to take this chance of red coin exploring to um, go get some blue coins I know about at first. First, you spin that one really fast. You get a blue coin. Next, is that guy there yet? No, he's there later. But, but remember, there are some guys that you need to clean in the game and then you get blue coins. I believe there's a blue coin over in one of these stupid trees. I'm pretty sure it's this one. Yep, you spray in the middle of there and you get a blue coin. Uh, I will be getting all the blue coins, of course, to get 120 stars. There's 120 stars. Um, it, 120 stars only gets you a little photo at the end after you beat it again, 120. And um, the final boss, you get, you beat it, and then it actually gives you a star in this game, which is different from all the other games before. Uh, actually, is it? Wait, yeah, it is. Okay, so that's the unique thing about this game also. Plenty of unique things about this game. I actually, that was, makes it really nice to me, and I love this game. I also grew up more on this game because I grew up more in the 2000s, without, you know, the 2000s here. And there's a blue coin right there if you kill him. 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 Oh, 
there's a guy up here that I think will give you a blue coin, I believe. I'm pretty sure, hey, hello, hello, hello. Oh yeah, this guy either gives you a blue coin here or over there on this pathway on another star. Yep. So that's him. So, so yeah, okay. Um, what else to talk about? The Wii U, I already talked about that in another video, but I guess I can say how I like this. These are Skeeters from Super Mario 64. There are two blue coins underwater in this lake. This is one of them. Uh, the other one I will be going to shortly after this one, because it's just, you know, make the loot. And, um, is there also in this game, there's a separate life gauge for... Uh, swimming, so you cannot, like, unlike Super Mario 64, you cannot just go back up and refill your your original health if you're dying in, um, up, up land, on land, basically. You can't just say, hey, I'll go back up and rebreathe, and then refill your life gauge. No, nope, that's not how it works. It's separate for underwater and land, so that's a big thing they did, too. Uh, I'm pretty sure that blue coin's around here. Somewhere is that not here or what? Whoa, 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 wait. Hold on. It must be over here. Oh, is this stupid or what? Is it not here yet? Or is this one not here yet? Yet? I guess this one's not here yet. Sorry. Sorry to say it, but it's true. That, that's weird to me. Oh well. I guess that's, that's perfectly fine. Uh, I don't want to spend too much time, um, on blue coins and stuff, so, yeah. Yeah, I'm glad to be back on this Let's Play stuff. Yeah, I'm in the mood lately. I will all, and summer's coming up, so I'll definitely be off way more often. So, school, of course. You know, as you can understand, that's why there's, like, been limited videos, of course, and it's not like anyone cares. It's who watches these things. <sighs> I sure don't watch my videos. Although, I might start... Well, why? Because I record them, so I know what happens, I know what do what does them, and I, I don't really need to watch mine, because why well, watch my own stupid shit? It's stupid, that's right. I call. I called it. I called it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's pick up our first blue, red coin while picking up, picking up our tenth blue coin. We can. I'm not gonna turn every blue coin in. I'm not gonna turn them all. I'm gonna turn them all in at once. Okay. So basically, you get 96 stars from anywhere else. Delfino Plaza has a lot of stars, and then you, and then you get the other 24 from the blue coins. So that's kind of pathetic. You don't even make it do a hundred without blue coins. That's funny. So really, so for real, real stars, like good quality stars that are fun to get and like original and just, um, you know, added to this game that isn't stupid blue coin crap, is 96. And then the other 26 is just fucking pathetic blue coins. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, look at me. I think this might be the last star before I stop because I'm done talking to a camera that no one sees. And it, this video's long. Yeah, almost 40 minutes. This is going to be my longest video I've ever uploaded. Hands down. I've never uploaded anything over 30 minutes. Because I could never do it. But now I can, and now I'm going to start doing it. Especially since I've been gone for so long. So, and this Let's Play, I don't know how long it's going to be. It can be forever, I don't know. It just depends, okay? I don't think that can hit me from here. Just kind of collecting blue coins before I get to the star, but there's plenty more stars in this level to go. Or shine sprites, they're not stars in this game. You can call them that, but that's not really what they are, so you'd be like... Mm. Shut up. Shut up. Wall jumping is also your friend in this game. Wind is definitely not your friend. Wind is probably the mo one of the most annoying things in this game. 
Mario B, Mario A, Mario C. So, what am I? What do I need to talk about? You know. Okay, so I was at school today and I had some pineapple flavored ice, frozen yogurt, I guess. It's not ice cream, it's frozen yogurt. And, um, yeah, it's actually really pretty good. And I had it with Cheez Its and I was like, here's a great idea Cheez It ice cream sandwich. You put ice cream in between two Cheez It, like, but they'd be bigger extended Cheez Its, but. You know, same yummy taste and salt of Cheez Its and whatever flavor you want, you know, just make a ton of flavors of ice cream, you know, but make it a good, you know, that'd be cool. I think that's a good idea, you know, because Cheez Its and ice cream for me go together well. And I'm gonna get this blue coin here, please. Yes, coin, and I love it. Vanilla, and um, so far, cookies and cream has not been good, but. Pineapple and vanilla with Cheez Its is good. Uh, chocolate, I haven't tried that, but it's pretty good. So, I think I should probably not say that because then people will take my idea and make millions, and then I'll be like, fuck you! And I'll get, actually, I'll be really pissed, and I don't know what I'll do. I'll just be like, I'll just be angry for, for about it for a while and be like, that's my idea! And I won't, I won't drop it if people say how much of a good idea that is. And I'll never drop it. Ever. So. So it's my turn to make millions, bitches. Although I don't think that's a very good idea because I, don't, I doubt people are gonna. I don't. I don't think that many people would actually eat that because I don't think that many people actually would like that. So, um, yeah. So, you know. So where's that last fucking coin? Oh, there it is. Ooh, I know, I know, I know, I know where it is. I know where it is. I know where it is. And, okay, collected. And there you go. Now time to collect the shine spray. Oh my god, stop explaining things. You idiot, you're explaining it like people are stupid. Collect the shine spray. Well, no shit, Sherlock. Yes, yeah, so... And there's also rumors I've been hearing about this game being a prequel. Or no, not a prequel. Yeah, no, a prequel to Luigi's Mansion. And Luigi's Mansion is a sequel to this game. Um, in some, in some description. And I'll tell you, I'll, I'll tell you why when we get to a certain point in the game. Basically, I'll say it later. I'll talk about it later. 